Hello again everybody and welcome back to Fuji's Blitz. Now, if there are three things that Blitz players will always, always, always moan about, it's going to be the following. One, matchmaker. Mm, it's not the matchmaker guys, it's the team quality and the player quality, but that's a different argument. Two, RNGesus. Everybody moans about RNG, regardless of whether or not we are, you know, aiming or hitting our targets, we still blame RNG. And number three, win rate. Everybody's infatuated with win rate. You've got to have a good light blue win rate for anybody in this game apparently to take you seriously. And if you don't have a light blue win rate, that's got a six at the beginning of it, then apparently you're just a complete and utter noob and you have no clue what you're doing. So everybody's infatuated with those three things and they're always going to be main talking points. So, and there are hundreds of videos on there. You know, how to improve your win rate, how to get better, how to get to 60%. And to be fair, you know, a lot of it is very good pointers, but you know, not really going to help you unless you grind and grind and grind and change your overall skill base. So. This is a video that's going to tell you how to improve your win rate and how to win more games. That is guaranteed, funnily enough. And do you know what that is? Stop being antisocial, find yourself a friend or a buddy, and jump into a tune. Seriously, jump into a tune. Because you are now putting the odds in your favour. If you go alone in random battles, then the chances are 98% of the team, you're not going to have a clue who they are, you don't know what their skill level's like, you're going to be completely uncoordinated, and your communication's going to suck, and you're just going to lose or get toxic, or by the grace of God, if you're lucky enough, you'll win. However, if you jump into a tune, you can go onto Discord. You can talk to each other, you can tell each other what you're going to do, you can coordinate your attack, you can watch each other's backs. If you want to go to sea, go to sea together, rather than say go to sea and watch the entire team go to A, if you're on Supremacy. Tuning up is a sure-fired way for you to win more games. It's not a fallacy. And this is the other thing, and I only found this out realistically over the last day. If you're in a tomb, like I tombed yesterday with my uh, one of my clan members and one of the clan leads, Laura Y, and you know what? We went out in t every tier we went in, we were never bottom tier. So we tuned up in tier 9, we never faced a single tier 10 game. We tuned up in tier 8, didn't face a single tier uh, 9 game. We were top tier each and every time. Now, I, I haven't really looked into this before, but you know what? Played about 40 odd games yesterday in tombs, never once was I bottom tier. So not only do you have the communication advantage, not only do you have the advantage of being with somebody who's got your back and you've got their back, and you can help each other, and you know actually as you, each other plays, but you've also got the advantage of not being bottom tier, of being top tiered. So what are you waiting for? Get into a tune, find yourself a friend, stop being antisocial, get out there, grab a buddy, get your win rate up. Because seriously, it really will help you. And if you tune with a player who is better than you, well, he'll give you tips. He'll tell you how to play the bloody tank. And you'll be even better. And you'll win even more games. And you'll have fun. I mean, Laura and I last night, we tuned live on stream. We did a variety of tanks and a variety of tiers. And I think we had close to a 70% win rate. I think it was 68 point something percent win rate for the day. That's after like 40 odd battles. I mean, this is what you can do, guys. And don't sit there thinking, ah, but Fuji, you're the biggest world's, you're the world's biggest nab. And Laura carried you. No, he didn't. I did in a few games, but I also carried him in a few games. You're just not seeing those games, but you may see them later. <laughs> I don't know yet. Depends how mean I want to be to Loro. So you can carry each other and that's the thing. One of you dies, at least you've helped whittle down the team. And we, we didn't lose that many games overall and we had good damage 
And okay, that was a muppet move by me because I'm a complete nap and I know I'm a nap, but you know what? It was fun and that's the thing. And this is the glorious thing about being in a tune. You are seriously improving your overall chances to win guys. Really, you are. So if you really want to improve your win rate and you're fed up with the state of the game, I don't know, matchmaker or the state of the teams, get a buddy, get a friend, be annoyed together, get frustrated together, but maybe, just maybe, your win rate will go up and you'll have great fun. Anyway, I've been Fujit. That's been a quick video on why you should too have a good win rate. By all means, comment, like, and everything below. If you've got any decent replays, wing them across to me, fujitsblitz at gmail.com. And don't forget, Lurio has also got his own YouTube channel, so get over there. Give him a like and a sub. Why not? Cost you nothing, doesn't hurt. Until the next time, guys, stay safe out there, and look at that for a mastery for Lurio. Yeah, OP. Stay safe out there, have fun on the battlefield, and happy tanking, because that is what it's all about. Having fun, being happy.